out here at Maker Fair 2013 with the guys from Motorola. Um, yeah. yeah! A lot of excitement from Motorola today. All right, so guys, tell us who you are and what do you do at Motorola? Hi, I'm Jason, and I drive trucks at Motorola. I am Daniel. I'm chief designer of the innovation group at Motorola. Okay, so now, Inventables, we're from Chicago. We know the Motorola guys a little bit. This is a new uh, model for you guys, driving trucks. I haven't heard of the Motorola truck tour before, so tell us, what the heck's going on? So we're going around the country. We're going to go about 10,000 miles, visiting all four major maker fairs, 12 colleges, and we've got some really cool phones. Daniel, want to show? we got some cool, hackable, makeable, unlockable phones that we want people to make cool things with. So that's what we're doing this summer. So uh, tell us, like, what, what do you hope comes out of this? Well, so traditionally what's been happening with, you know, electronic devices is that is that companies have said, hey, this is what this is this is perfect, we've designed it and don't touch it, otherwise you'll void your warranty. We want to see what happens when you flip that on its head, take take our phones, unlock them, open it up and ask people what do they want to do with it and help make some of their dreams into reality. Cool. So where did you guys grow up? I grew up in Chicago actually. I grew up in Connecticut. Okay, and then how old were you when you started making stuff? I don't know. I made poop at a pretty young age. <laughs> after after poop. I don't know. Probably like three or four. What were you making at three or four? Elaborate racetracks out of uh, with those wind up car things. Daniel, I made stuff out of paper and set it on fire. <laughs> did, did your parents encourage that kind of uh, pyro behavior? Actually, yeah. So I never had a playroom. My dad's an artist and my mom's an actress, and so they set up a room that was just paint and cardboard and I could paint and create anywhere actually growing up. That's pretty cool. So th did you go to school for art or engineering? Uh, I studied product design and engin engineering. Okay. I studied international relations and multimedia. Okay. So it's a very international project you have going on here. That's right. That's right. So uh, t tell me the plan. So you're starting here in California. Like w what's the tour look like? After here we're heading down to LA where we're going to be stopping at Caltech and Art Center. Then we're going to zip across to somewhere in the mountains. We're not quite sure yet. Probably dip south into Texas, hit up Kansas City Maker Fair, do something in the Midwest, Detroit Maker Fair. All right, Daniel just punked you. All right, now, Daniel, show us. Okay, so we're going across the country. We're doing all four Maker Fairs. We're doing about a dozen of the nation's top universities, both engineering and design students. And we're just going to go to everyday people's houses as well. We're going to, like, go to people's houses and, like, print action figures of their kids and, like, fix their dishwashers and do all kinds of crazy stuff. So we're talking about, like, the other day you just got, like, a huge order of acrylic from Venables and all sorts of cool materials. We're talking about probably putting a Shapoko mill in in the, the van. What do you hope people mill? I don't know. I think that's the most exciting thing about this trip. We don't know what people are going to want to make, but we're going to get there. They're going to tell us what they want to make, and we're going to help them make it. What do you want to make? I want to make a quadcopter. What's a quadcopter for people who might not know? It's a helicopter thingy that hovers, but it has four rotors, so it can like tilt and like hover and move up and down. You can attach cameras to it, so you can like do aerial, aerial videos. So wh what were you doing two years ago? I was in school. Okay. Wh wh where'd you go to school? I went to Sanford. Daniel, what were you doing two years ago? Two years ago, I was heading up our global design research team at Motorola. Oh, that sounds very like corporate and official. <laughs> All right, so it's two th it's a, it's a, it's a 2013 Maker Fair. In one year, 2014, what are we going to see from you guys? Awesome, cool stuff. We're going to be 3D printing some amazing stuff you wouldn't believe next year. All right, so for the makers at home who are actually going to see you as you tour the country, maybe they're in high school, maybe they're in college, what words of uh, advice do you have for them? If you have something that you want to make, don't let feasibility or cost or like how crazy it is stop you. Just go out there and make it, and we'll be there to help you. Daniel? Yeah, totally. Just use whatever tools you got, Play-Doh, cardboard, markers, Sharpie markers, whatever. Just make what you want, and then that'll give you a vision for how to do it in something better later on. Awesome. Guys, we look forward to seeing you on the road and getting some updates. All right. All right.